for it and one for that this industry and shit. And I, I, done, I done seen a lot of shit. I done took a lot of loss in the crowds since then. You know what I'm saying? A lot of shit done transpired since then. You know what I'm saying? So. Yeah, well, nigga, we in here debating on who was the gangsters, nigga. We done had on the show, nigga. You was in the running. Nah, I ain't, <laughs> I ain't no G or no G. I'm just kidding. Do me like Pooh said. Never had cable when watching no movie, but watching Labusa on bootleg. So let me ask you something, man. Like when you, when how do you? Okay, and I'm gonna go into the Gucci Man thing yeah. too, the 1017. But I want to first talk about you and Trap Boy. Like for some reason, this cat said you were the hardest nigga out of Texas when you first when you came and you know did your thing. He had a lot of respect for you, man. So how did y'all even wind up knowing each other, man? And nigga Trap, this was before Yellow Beezy blew up and shit like that. Yellow Beezy before Yellow Beezy blew up. You know what I'm saying? For anybody, if a, only nigga, only nigga that was coming that they had, who had that uh, like they were coming out, they had that they, they had clout and Dallas that, that like my that before three even blew up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Before three even blew up, and all that shit had happened and shit like that. But I had only nigga that nigga was jamming out the D was Chief. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. A little bit of Lil' Runny. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Lil' Runny was driving a little hit or two here, hit or two there. You know what I'm saying? Some fly shit. Nigga kicking some fly shit. But goddamn, I mean, other than that, Trap was the only nigga that I knew. But I knew Trap from the streets. You know what I'm saying? I ain't know Yellow Bees in the streets. I know don't Yellow Bees on my dime, but I'm saying, like, I, uh, goddamn, I knew Trap from the streets. So, you know what I'm saying? Trap was, uh, you know what I'm saying? This was before Trap. Just Trap had a street name and shit. But he was, he had told me so he had told me like twelve hundred dollars, thirteen hundred dollars for a verse. Okay. And you know what I'm saying? My niggas was like, my niggas in the trap, like, man, that nigga ain't even worth no thirteen hundred dollars. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> like, 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 man, how the fuck you put a price on a nigga dope, nigga? Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That nigga feel like nigga, you know what I'm saying? Nigga giving me a chill. That's why you don't never listen to a nigga, you man. Never listen to a nigga. You, you right. don't never listen to no motherfucking nigga. Never. You, you talking to your dreams, you you tell a nigga about your dreams, about your moves, you don't never even post tell about them to where they made already. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got to find a decision on your moves. You know what I'm saying? But I'm saying, you know what I'm saying? I would have listened to a nigga and not got that fee. Bro, ain't no telling how my, ain't no telling how my life would have turned out. Nah, that's dope, bro. Because cause like I said, the way that you would... Besides all that, the nigga down with you at the end like that. He seen something in you. Oh, man, that's my he dog, He seen bro. something in you, bro. That's I ain't dope. Gonna lie, that, man, that's my motherfucking dog, man. I ain't never asked that nigga for shit, bro. That nigga ain't never gave me shit, but that's my motherfucking nigga. Like, I know if it came down to it, Know what I'm saying? That nigga gonna be one of the niggas in my corner when all this shit start burning up. You That's know what I'm saying? Man. That's good. It ain't man. never about what a nigga give you or what you can get out of a nigga. You know, it's what a nigga more standpoint is. You know what I'm That's saying? That's real. That's real. So yeah. I was just trying to find that song because y'all had a song. The first song y'all did together. That's the one. Yeah. But I don't know. If that, what was it? Yeah, that was it, that big time, because you got a liking for look, the nah, BG name listen, up there. I but see. listen, that ain't even the first song we did. The song I paid them $1,300, well, 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 I well. never, it got lost in the song. <laughs> <laughs> I ended up getting locked up in some more shit after that. <laughs> So that was the, so the first one was the one that you lost. Nah, the first but one. But that was hard. Damn, I can't even remember what I said on the hot. Like, man, I said some. I got the sum in the matches. Ain't no more hustling back with some, some, some. That's all I remember. I'd be so high. But what I'm saying, you know, we recorded that hoe. We recorded that hoe. Hold on. This my baby mom right here. I got to answer. <laughs> That's my baby mama right man, here. You better have some baby nah, mama. for real. That was she cheating. Hey, man, yeah, make it this all good. This her first pregnancy, too. She uh, swear, you know what I'm mean? saying? <laughs> she hell. That first one, hell, uh, boy. Hell, I yeah. remember you the way you acted. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> she <laughs> hell. She, How um, far along is she? She probably like nine, eight weeks. She like eight weeks. Oh, okay, she just yeah, started. Yeah, she don't answer. She had it at all. <laughs> you know they free pretty so they go to the doctor and they tell them any little thing that ain't looking right, they got a mm -hmm. Oh yeah, it's it's for serious. Sure. It's very right, she serious. She on the phone on we live. Man, what? but you know, um the thing I can say about you, man, is I you a breath of fresh air when it comes to the music. I've been listening to your music all day. I already have been listening yep. to it, but I just mm -hmm. love the fact that we don't get the much raw, nigga. We it's raw get, I'm gonna make these niggas respect us. No, you already did. I'm like, my mama, I'm going to make these niggas. Nah, they don't respect us enough when it comes to the Texas shit. They don't. They don't do They it. don't. I don't give a fuck what they say. You've they always don't. said that. Yeah, I know. You've they don't respect that. us. Hey, I'm real hard these on niggas that. These niggas get their whole swag from us. You know what I'm saying? That come from Eve right there. You hear me? See, that they think, because I'm a Pimp C fan, because I and know how he held it down for the sound. Uh, and I, I'm just straight at everybody. This is, it, matter of fact, Lil Deezy said, I was, when, uh, he was like, uh, you, uh, you, you, you just Texas everything, Eve. Say, Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.